through the whole box. p.m. Hello, uh, Roger. <laughs> it's Elaine Hargreave. I'm just letting you know that I'm back in town for good this time. I, I'd love to catch up sometime soon, so give me a call on my old number and we'll set something up. <laughs> Looking forward to seeing you. Bye. May 20th. 10.04 a.m. Hello, Mr. Doyle. This is Michael from Blockbuster Video. I'm just calling to let you know that you've got a couple movies that are currently overdue. If you'd be able to give us a call back or drop them in sometime today, that'd be great. Thanks. Bye. Joan first. 9.15 p.m. Hi, Roger. It's Elaine. I realize you might not want to meet up with me. Obviously, that's fine. That's your decision. I was kind of hoping we could talk at least. Uh, I have a lot of stuff I'd like to talk about. Give me a call when you get this. Bye. You're on 7, 11.06 a.m. Hello, this is Judy Vale calling from Brighton White Dennis. Just a friendly call letting you know that you're due for a checkup this month. If you'd like to call back and make an appointment, that'd be great. Thanks so much. Bye. July. 25th, 8.57 p.m. Look, Roger, I get it, okay? I hurt you, I know that, but I was hoping you'd be mature enough to hear an apology or even forgive me. But I suppose that would be asking too much. We both moved on. I was just hoping to extend a hand of friendship when I heard about the divorce of someone who's gone through the same thing. You need to let people in, Roger. Or at least stop being a child when it comes to your emotions. Bye-bye. This sounds like a familiar tune. August 2nd, 3.19 a.m. Hi, it's Elaine. I I just called because, I don't know, I, I'd hope you'd pick up. I knew you wouldn't, obviously. I, I'm not crazy. It's just that... All I have left of you is your phone number in my little book. And I don't have photos or letters. I, I, I ran into your daughter today, and she told me I, I didn't even know you were sick. I wanted to say I was sorry for all the messages. Even though I left them after you died, I just felt I... I just wanted to tell you, Roger... That I never stopped loving you. <sighs> that I'm sorry I left. <laughs> I guess that's all. Goodbye, Roger. <laughs> 